Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's my Kenyan Puff. As you can see, I finally blew out my hair. So I went to the salon yesterday and I got a blowout and trimmed um, my hair. I, I actually trimmed off one to one and a half inches. I tried to get rid of the color so most of the color is out there's still some but didn't want to budge but yeah my ends are now healthy it's already puffing up so i had to do this video today because i was not sure when i'd get the chance during the week to film and also my hair is already shrinking um so i just wanted you guys to see the length difference I did lose a lot of length from that trim so I can't say that there's a big difference between um, my one year update which I link down below and the length of my hair now I mean it's grown slightly longer but nothing nothing really to write home about so um, in preparation for my two-year uh, anniversary, which will be sometime next year, I want to retain um, as much length as possible. If I can retain all the length that I get, I'll be really happy. Because this year, I've not really been protective styling. I've been doing a lot of manipulation on my hair. Um, and now I really want to go full on into low manipulation. And protective style mode so you will see that my hair will be in twists or in braids a lot more just to keep my hair away give it a break and it's also just because life is getting busier and busier I don't have the time or the energy to be manipulating my hair all every single week or every two weeks so um, I think protective styling is really going to help um, I don't think there's too much uh, change in my regimen so far. I just basically have been shampooing every 10 to 14 days. I have been shampooing every time I wash. I thought of incorporating co-washing but I've not had the chance to co-wash my hair because every time I need to wash my hair I need to shampoo it whether it's before a protective style, after a protective style, after a blowout for example. So for me, shampooing and deep conditioning with every wash is just what I've been doing. And yeah, finally, I'm really, really happy. I like the shape of my hair and I'm happy that now my hair is healthy. I can't wait to <laughs> get my curls back and see if there'll be a difference in my twist outs or anything. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd show you guys an update of how my hair is looking health is really important to the length don't forget yes we are all chasing some goals not everyone has length goals but I do definitely so I don't want to be set back but this is not a setback this is actually promoting health of my hair and in that journey to true length because if you have long hair but 50% of it is split ends then you have no length you know so this is all healthy thick hair my hair is thick <laughs> yo it's really thick I love it so much it's a lot of work though but it is thick so it's it's really really healthy and i'm just happy i don't know if you guys have any questions i'll do a q a video um pretty soon so if you have any questions about my hair and my regimen products um 
breakage, hair loss, I don't know anything. If you just have any questions to do with um, hair care, please leave them down in the comments. DM me or email me and I will kind of compile them all together and do a video covering those questions. But yeah, I'm really happy. Um, when it comes to trimming, I have no advice for how often you should trim. Trim when your ends need it. Whether that's once a year for you or once every three months for some people, just trim when you need to trim. I knew I needed a trim and I'm really happy. I feel <coughs> lighter and wild. I actually went <coughs> out like this yesterday and to church. I knew the looks like there's this culture that um, when your hair is blown out, uh, you're probably preparing to get into a protective style or you've not yet styled your hair like you're going to the salon It's not expected that you just walk around with your hair looking like this So I did get a few stares, but I also got a few compliments. So the point is um, Embrace your hair <laughs> Embrace your crown wear it out how you feel like be confident um, you might inspire someone else too let their hair out and do the same. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, always remember your hair is your crown. Embrace it, take care of it, and love it. God bless you all. Goodbye.